Very happy returns. Good morning, good morning, good morning. And what a lovely day it is again. Rise and shine, rise and shine. First, your weather. It will be hot and fine all day, though the fresh breeze will continue. How much further? About two miles. If your geography is correct, just around the next headland. Tell me, who's she? Nadia Rakovsky. Oh, really? And what was her name before she left Peckham Rye to train for the Bolshoi Ballet? You haven't changed, have you? She told me she was an Estonian. In the village. The village? She was known as number eight. Don't you know about the village? I'm here to ask questions, old boy. That's what number two used to say. Number two? Chairman of the village. What village? I just forgot you don't know, do you? The village. Is a place where people turn up. People who have resigned from a certain sort of job have defected or have been extracted. The specialized knowledge in their heads is of great value to one side or the other. Are you sure you haven't got a village here? Where is this village? Lithuania, the Baltic. 30 miles from the Polish border. How did you find out? Nadia told me. How did she know? She used to work for their government. She came across a secret file. On how to catch a spy in six lessons. I risked my life and hers to come back here, home, because I thought it was different. It is, isn't it? Isn't it different? My dear chap, I do apologize. You had a long journey. You must be exhausted. Now, I expect you could do the decent drink. It's got 24 work units. What? That's how much it costs in the village. Ah, yes. The 
the village. Surely you know about it. All I know, old boy, is that you resigned from a post of the highest possible secrecy in this country, refused to give your reasons, and then promptly vanished. I was kidnapped. Oh, really? How dramatic. And then, after a gap of months, we suddenly receive a suitably coded message that you're coming back from the other side of the Iron Curtain. You think I've gone over? And come back here to carry on the good work. No. No, he says, no, yet, yet. What sort of imbeciles do you think we are? young and there are many questions. First, why did you resign? Big Ben. It's just struck eight. My watch says eight. So? I was given this watch by a man in Poland. I particularly wanted it to check the time to make sure that the trip tallied with the journey to London. Which it presumably did. Yes, of course. Would you like to explain to me how a man in Poland came to have a watch showing English time when there's one hour's difference. Maybe he was slow. I'll bet he was. Congratulations. Come again. 
Allow me to introduce myself. I am number 113, and this is my photographic colleague, Smile. number 113B. We uh, contribute to the local newspaper, the Tally Ho, you know. Right on. This is red-hot stuff, you know. Haven't had a candidate of your caliber for ages. Congratulations. How are you going to handle your campaign? No comment. Intends to fight for freedom at all Smile. costs. How about your internal policy? No comment. We'll tighten up on village security. Smile! How about your external policy? No comment. Our exports will operate in every corner of the globe. How do you feel about life and death? Mind your own business. No comment. <laughs> Come tomorrow. Good night, children. <laughs> 